Fabian from Lifesparring.com. If you followed my channel previously or have seen uh, videos before, then you know I usually cover topics uh, around self-improvement and very often this includes reviews uh, of devices, apps, uh, similar to measure body data and yeah, help you to potentially improve something in your life. The last big review that I did was about uh, a brand new body fat scale from WeThinks, um, the WeThinks body scan. And um, yeah, in the meantime, I think we are at around 1,500 views um, for this video. And there were quite a lot of comments um, about this comparison of accuracy in body fat scanning with a um, body fat scale um, that is um, yeah, electric body impedance base um, compared to a DEXA scan, which is kind of the gold standard in body composition measurements. So apparently there is um, a lot of interest in the topic of body composition. And there was a lot of uh, questions to do a follow up. And today this is somewhat of a follow up even though not exactly, because um, I will talk again about body composition and we also revisit um, the we things a bit. But actually what I want to do today is to introduce you to something brand new and um, I'm quite excited about it. OK, the app that I want to introduce you today is called Spren. S-P-R-E-N and it's uh, by a company called Elite uh, HRV. Um, it was a contact uh, made via LinkedIn and um, yeah, I simply replied to a LinkedIn post introducing the app and I got very excited because the promise of uh, Spren is very simple. It's a body composition measurement via your phone camera. And um, yeah, the app looks like this. And yeah, I'm just going to demonstrate it to you. Normally you would do um, the scan um, just wearing underwear, ideally. Um, I did this before, but uh, I spare you uh, looking at me uh, wearing underwear. Hence, I do it now um, in closing um, just to show you how it functions and how quick it is. So basically you download the app. At the moment, um, you can only um, activate it when you have a code. Good thing is you can get a code uh, from me here um, towards the end of the video. Um, and um, yeah, then try it out by yourself. So you download the app, you put in the activation code, and then it's fairly simple. So you put in your current weight, and then you have to answer a few um, health and fitness questions, simply that the app gets an idea um, about um, your fitness level. So um, how many push-ups can you do and in which position? Like, do you need knee support or do you do it in a proper plank position? Then what's your running time um, for kilometer um, yeah, or a mile? And um, yeah, then here's the introduction, how you scan it. I mean, of course, we have minimal closing. As I said, the way I'm doing it right now is not the right way. I just do it to demonstrate the app. Um, put up your hair, not a problem in my case, obviously. Um, and then you do it um, from a distance of um, yeah, one to two meters. You stand against the wall. And important is that the phone stands upright. So how I do it is um, I'm using um, this kind of magnetic uh, phone stand um, that's super easy then to uh, um, adjust. Uh, that's an absolute hack. But you can try, of course, um, do it um, by balancing the phone differently. Um, as I said, four to six feet, one or two meters away is the distance that you should measure. Um, yeah, this is basically how it is. And um, let's just measure. Yeah, yeah, let's go. 
I ain't the first with the curse, with the thirst that I wanna be better, not worse. Man, it hurts. I'm on this earth with my words, and I put them all together in cert, cause I wanna have worth. Working hella hard till they put me in the dirt. Gonna go far, man, listen to my words. Gonna be a star, man, life's like a blur. When you're working this hard, yeah, you get what you deserve. Yeah, I ain't taking a backseat, I'm passing. And anybody else who is rapping, I'm nasty. Ain't nobody able to catch me, they gasping. They cannot compare, they can't match me, I'm at half speed. I got your girl and she laughs. Laughing and dancing, hanging on my what she asking to crash with me, smash with me. She's savage, she wants cash money, and she knows that I live lavishly. Uh, I wanna live, I'm cold inside. Give all I have just to feel alive. I fight to live, I fight to strive. One day I'll have what I want. I want the whole world. That's it. So, previously, of course, you put in um, your height, uh, your gender, um, answer a few questions. So now the scan runs and checks. So basically, it uploads um, your pictures to the cloud, runs some um, the analytics in the cloud. They promise that they will delete your photos uh, within a day. Um, unless you participate in research. And um, yeah, at the moment it's free. See the results. And this is the result output. So result output here, 20.9% body fat. But um, yeah, I was very close. So let's actually look into um, a previous um, result. So you can hear on the results in the app, see your reports of previous scans. And this is the one I did this morning, properly, adequately dressed and only my tighty whiteies. So this is how the report looks like. Um, of course here, um, height, age, data that you previously provided, and then, yeah, body fat percentage, 20.6% was the scan this morning. So the Spren app is great. It's easy to use. Um, it's amazingly fast. Um, but how good is the result? So how accurate is it? So unfortunately, I didn't do a DEXA scan uh, just uh, recently. Hence, um, I cannot compare it to the gold standard of body composition measurements. But I think I have a few other data points that we can reference it to and can get a good idea on how accurate SPRAN actually is. So the first thing that we can do is we can take a look into my WeThinks app. So uh, I demonstrated this last time. Um, WeThinks is off, unfortunately, quite a bit on body um, fat for me. So. Currently, I measure 15.5% uh, body fat. And um, yeah, when I did the DEXA comparison um, with WeThings, WeThings was off by around 10% body fat. So SPRAN being around 5% uh, higher um, is already a good sign because that means it's definitely more accurate uh, than WeThings because I can assure you I do not have 15.5% body fat. It would be nice. I would probably have even a six pack by then, but uh, yeah, I am still far away from it. So this is uh, the first data point. What um, is quite interesting um, is that I have lost quite a bit of weight over um, the course of the last month. So this is uh, my weight um, over the year. I started, um, and that's when I did the DEXA scan um, with uh, above 90 uh, kg, and um, I'm right now pretty stable at uh, around 81-ish, um, so somewhere between 80 and 82, um, pretty stable. So that means I lost around 8, 9 kg since the DEXA scan. And um, yeah, if I look at what we things um, says, I lost we things uh, things I lost around uh, five percent body fat um, over this time, um, and this would mean around sixty percent uh, uh, fat loss 
40% lean mass loss. This is pretty standard. So like whenever you lose weight, even if you do it in a healthy way, you cannot lose 100% body fat. You always lose a mix of uh, lean mass and fat mass simply because even yeah, fat mass um, has some lean mass in it. There's water uh, that you will lose um, at any time. So um, that's yeah, just in the nature of things. When you lose weight, you also always lose um, lean mass. So around 60% um, is the estimate. Okay, so I'm sure you want to kind of uh, get the numbers uh, a bit more in detail. So yeah, let's do that whole exercise and uh, show you what we got. So um, this is my DEXA scan from January. Um, I showed this data when I did the uh, WeThink review. At that time, yeah, I had a whooping 32% body fat, 91.8% uh, uh, kg total mass. Nothing I'm particularly proud of, pretty nasty data, I know. But yeah, there's some progress in the meantime. As I demonstrated at that time, we things had me um, yeah, off by around 10%. Um, that's pretty massive. But... Anyway, we are not talking about we things um, right now. Let's get an estimate on where I would be today. So, um, yeah, 91.8 kg was what I measured in during this uh, uh, DEXA scan. 81.5 is uh, what we measured uh, today. So I lost 10.3 kg. Estimate, solid estimate, um, also what we think uh, uh, things um, I, I did was uh, losing 60% body fat, 40% lean mass. So if I apply 60% on the 10.3 kg um, and then um, deduct this from the 27.7 kg fat mass that I had in January, I would end up with around 22 point something uh, kg fat mass and this would be um, an estimated 26.42% um, body fat coming down from the 32% um, that the DEXA had me at that time. So as I demonstrated last time, all of the um, electric body impedance uh, scales were off by between 5 or 6 um, to 10% the body scan being off the worst um, by 10%. And um, yeah, so right now, we think it has me at 15.5%, as I said, I wish. And 20.6% um, was the result from Spren. And yeah, if 26.4% is a realistic estimate uh, for um, a DEXA scan, um, then I think we are not that uh, worse off. So that means uh, pretty much that Spren is as accurate as the, the most accurate of the BIA um, scales is. That I think for an app that um, is free right now and uses your phone um, as technology is pretty impressive. Now, I have another data point that we can take a look at because um, I did recently a scan on um, a device called um, 3D Fit. And this is a massive um, device. Um, it costs, I, I don't know exactly, but around three to 5,000 US dollar. Um, it's a big platform. You stand on it, um, ideally also just wearing underwear. And then um, the platform slowly spins in 360 degree and a camera takes a surround picture of you and yeah, it's it's quite freaky because uh, yeah, you get <laughs> pretty accurate uh, 3D shapes um, of you. So this is how I look like. Um, and um, it also estimates body fat pretty much with the same technology that Spran uses. So like camera based body fat uh, recognition. And um, yeah, I was a kilo lighter on that day and it had me at 22.65% body fat. So slightly higher. But yeah, within 2% body fat um, of the SPRAN result. And um, as I said, this is a device that uh, costs a fortune and you would 
uh, alone for space reasons most likely not buy for your home use um, and um, yeah comparing this to the result of spren makes in my point of view the spren result even more impressive because yeah being within two percent um, of um, such an expensive device with technology that is so much cheaper is something that i really find impressive Okay, so that's that's pretty much about uh, what there is to say uh, about Sprint. I like the app. I like the result. I think it is not perfect. It's uh, most likely not perfectly accurate in my case. Maybe it's even better for you. But um, it's a great approach to body composition. It's better than a lot of very expensive devices. So you should definitely try it out. And... Um, yeah, as I promised, I actually have a code for you. So go to the App Store or the equivalent um, on uh, Android and um, download the Spren Body Composition app. And uh, then you simply use code Life Sparring Promo, no hyphen, just um, as you would type it, um, live sparring promo. That's the code, download the app, then it asks you for a code, you put this code in and you can use the app. And um, yeah, tell me how you like it, tell me how the result is. And um, I'm sure to come back with another video. Eventually I will do another DEXA scan and um, then, of course, um, I can put it all together. We have uh, DEXA, we have SPREN, we have um, the Wii Things uh, body scan, and then we can see yeah, where we are in terms of accuracy. Um, disclaimer, as always, things can differ from body to body. I have a special body uh, uh, composition that challenges uh, a lot of devices by being overall relatively slim and then having a little bit of a body fat concentration around my belly. It's not super unusual, I guess, but um, apparently a challenge for a lot of devices. So for you, it might be a bit different, but the only way to figure it out is by trying and by comparing. And yeah, that being said, that's it for today. I hope um, you subscribe um, to the channel. Um, I hope you come back for more videos like this. And uh, yeah, always happy about feedback, questions, and um, your own impressions of what we talked about today. Keep your hands up and stay safe uh, at all times. Cheers.